Training for a mission is as important for astronauts as the integrity of the spacesuits they wear to venture into the vacuum of space. One pre-flight training program, called the Crew Equipment Interface Test, or CEIT, is held at NASA's Kennedy Space Center in Florida prior to every mission. CEIT uh, is a test we do every flow, and it basically is the opportunity for the uh, flight crew to come down to see their actual vehicle they're going to fly in. And for the first time flyers, it might be the first time they've seen the actual shuttle they're going to fly in or just the shuttle in itself. For two days, the crew has a chance to get hands-on training with the actual tools, equipment, and hardware they'll be using while in orbit. And it's a good training exercise both for the crew and for the uh, in-flight maintenance uh, folks that come down here for CIT as well, and they verify their on-orbit procedures as well. Even as the space shuttle program comes to a close, CEIT remains a mainstay and an essential part of flight preparation. But every flight requires a specific training that focuses on the mission's objectives. In essence, CIT has been the same. Obviously, every mission's been different. The vehicle has been configured differently over all the years, and so every CIT is a little unique in that, you know, it incorporates the latest changes to the orbit. The crew, often dressed in clean room gear known as bunny suits, has a chance to climb into the vehicle and touch the actual dials, levers, and switches they'll be using in flight. Astronauts from other space agencies also travel to Kennedy for their training. There are times when the astronauts have come down here to KSC for the first time, especially when there's uh, people that are flying in from abroad, like from Canada or Japan or some of our partners. So they come down here and it's, it's an old brand new experience for them. A lot of times when they come down here, they want to look at everything, touch everything, be involved with everything so they really get a feeling of what it is to be in and around a, you know, a space shuttle. From cable routing and tool stowage to tile inspection and practicing in-flight maintenance tasks, CEIT makes the crew members better prepared to carry out their mission. Well, one of the unique things of working in this group is we do meet the astronauts and, you know, occasionally we get to know them very on a personal level. When the shuttle goes off, you know, we're with them and, uh, you know, we say Godspeed and hope to see them back here on the backside. You know, every mission is we get that lump in our throat and because it's more than just an expendable vehicle. We got, you know, the astronauts on board, and which makes it pretty unique. Every shuttle crew may be familiar with the vehicle and its equipment thanks to mock-ups, virtual reality tools, and other hardware training instruments at NASA's Johnson Space Center in Houston. But there's no substitute for training with the actual vehicle that will carry them into orbit. We try to do everything here on the ground to make everything, I'll say, perfect, as close to perfect as we can get it. So there's no issues on orbit for the crew have to go work. It makes us feel proud and then uh, when the crew comes back and thanks us, you know, which they do uh, almost after every flight, and, you know, we all feel good about that and we give everybody a group hug.